cautious, this tea recipe. This tea recipe. Hello lovely people. Welcome to Akosia's Tasty Recipe. I hope you are all doing well. So for today's recipe, I will be sharing with you how to make stuffed dinner rolls or bread rolls, okay? So please stay tuned and let's get started. In the mixer, I'll add three cups of all-purpose flour, one and a half tablespoon yeast, one fourth cup of white sugar you can use bread flour in place of all purpose flour so i'll mix everything together so the next thing i'll be adding is one teaspoon of salt okay then i'll give it a good mix and then i'll go ahead and add my wet ingredient so i'll add 85 grams of melted unsalted butter one large egg and then i'll give it a mix so i'm going to form a dough i have one cup of warm milk but i will add it in bit until a dough is formed you can replace unsalted butter with margarine but do not add salt if you're going to use margarine okay because margarine is salty so keep on adding the milk until you have a stiff and a very soft dough okay so at this point i have my dough you could see how fluffy and soft this looks okay so i'll transfer the dough in my mixing bowl but before then i'll go ahead and add oil and then rub it or spread it in the mixing bowl then i'll put my dough inside the oil will prevent the dough from sticking when it rises okay so i'm going to cover this and allow this to rise for 45 minutes The next thing I'm going to do is to make my filling, okay? So I'm going to use corned beef. You can use any protein of your choice. So in a mixing bowl, I'm going to put about half of the corned beef and then I'll add my vegetables. So I'm going for carrots, scallions, and onion, okay? Please feel free to use any vegetables of your choice and any protein of your choice. Then I'll mix everything together and then to make it more saucy i'm going to add one tablespoon of cage egg mayonnaise i'm using olive oil mayonnaise okay then i'll give it a good mix and then cover and set it aside So at this point, the 45 minutes is up and then the dough has doubled up in size. So I'll go ahead and then just knead it for a few minutes and then divide it into six, okay? Please feel free and divide it as many as you want, okay? okay so after dividing each dough weighs about 135 grams okay so i'm just going to mold it and then use a rolling pin to stretch it out it doesn't need to be perfect it just helps you to fill your dough with the filling yes so once it's stretched out go ahead and then scoop any amount you want and then put it in the middle or the center of the dough and then try to tuck in the ends to seal the filling 
in the door okay so that we after it bakes the filling doesn't come out so tuck in until everything is well sealed okay so this is exactly how it should look after you fill okay so i'm going to repeat the same step until i'm done filling all the dough Push us this tea recipe. This tea recipe. This tea recipe. Recipe. A dandy nabby, you betty. 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 So the next thing I'm going to do is to grab my baking dish and then spray with some cooking spray. This helps the bread from sticking when it's done baking or when it's out from the oven. You can use butter or margarine if you don't have cooking spray, okay? So I'm just going to arrange all my bread rolls inside the baking dish look at how beautiful it looks and then once everything goes in i'll go ahead and cover with a napkin and then allow it to rise for 30 minutes okay so after 30 minutes the bread has doubled up in size so i'll go ahead and then brush the top with some egg okay so this is going to give it that golden and beautiful color after the bread is out of the oven or after i'm done baking this okay so i will also top up with some sesame seeds you can use black or the white one whichever you want is fine but please whilst you're doing this make sure to preheat your oven to 250 degrees fahrenheit and then bake this for 30 minutes okay so after 30 minutes the bread is out of the oven so i'm just going to rub some butter on top of it to keep it soft all right yes it smells so so good this goes with any beverage or any juice any drink that you prefer this is amazing and it's so soft look at that i really enjoyed it please i said feel free to use any filling no yes look at the inside it tasted so so good okay so thank you so much for watching this recipe please if you do like this recipe don't forget to give me a thumbs up please subscribe and share and please kindly click on the notification bell so that whenever i upload you will be notified okay i really appreciate you all for watching this video god bless you all and happy mother's day to all women out there god richly bless everybody bye Ye beti banco chita kenke ye beti